Good morning, good morning. But I'm done something, 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 something. Good morning to you and you and you and you. Good morning, good morning. We are about to leave our hotel in Disney's All Star Movies Resort, which is very sad, but we're going to Universal today. So that's very exciting, isn't it? Yep. Yeah, we're going to check into Universal. Uh, Royal Pacific Resort. Lowe's Royal Pacific. Lowe's Royal Pacific Resort, it's called. Um, go to Universal Studios and Islands of Adventure, which we cannot wait for because we love it. It'd be nice to go on some big roller coasters today, like the Hulk. Hmm? Mm -hmm. Are you excited? Yep. So, we'll check in with you when we're there. See you in a bit. Just come to check out the Toy Story area of the hotel before we leave. So, so cool, all the theming here, isn't it? Huh? So cool. Yeah. Massive bucket of toy soldiers. Over there was the Fantasia pool we were in yesterday and where we stayed up there with 101 Dalmatians and the Mighty Ducks. I wish we stayed in this bit. <laughs> About to walk into Andy's room. Andy's room, keep out. Hey, this is Andy. Cool. Cool. So cool. That is awesome. How cool is that? <laughs> We're here. We've done pre-check-in at the hotel. We're ready. We're ready, I've got my Harry Potter shirt on. I've got my Jurassic Park lanyard. Tony's I've got, got a cat in the hat lanyard. We're ready to go ride some roller coasters. And eat crusty burgers. Eat crusty burgers. Not crusty burgers. Crusty burgers. Two I can, very different things. I can already hear Hulk. Oh. And that's getting me excited to ride because the Hulk is amazing. We're just walking along the garden walk from our hotel to the park. It's very nice. Yeah, very picturesque. Very, green, yeah. very humid though, but <gasps> there's a little squirrel. Oh, yeah, little squirrel. The squirrels in America are very skinny. Mm, I've very twice skinny. Twice I've seen a skinny squirrel. But I don't think it's the same one. Hmm, no. You Could saw a lizard last night, didn't you? I did see a lizard, a little baby lizard. We're here. We're just walking from Islands of Adventure there over to Universal Studios, their other park over here. There's the city walk over there, which is like restaurants, bars, a cinema, um, sports bar, lots of things. Here is the Toothsome Chocolate Emporium, which do some amazing freak shakes, do uh, savory food as well, like it is a restaurant. Yeah, savory food. Yeah, I'll have a quick look at the menu. So if you can see Roasted Brussels sprouts. Coffee and chocolate chicken wings. Mmm. Baked brie. Bit of gnocchi. Risotto. I just love the outside. Shrimp and lump crab mac and cheese. Oh, wow. So cool. Look at that. Everything over here is just done so well. Everything's just so huge. So, so huge. huge. Uh, it's just so huge. It's so huge. Margaritaville over there. It's actually the Conor McGregor Floyd Mayweather fight tonight, so hopefully we'll be able to find somewhere to watch that because just the biggest fight in the world in the history of boxing. So hopefully NBC Sports might be a good option. Slash, obviously they will be showing it. Here's a little glimpse of Rip Ride Rocket, which. I won't be doing this year because I hate the beginning of it, where you go up vertical. You say vertical, it is vertical, but it feels like you're going backwards and you're going to fall to your death. There you go, there's a little glimpse. But the cool thing is, with that ride, you get to choose music for your seat. You do. You select a song and it plays through speakers. Last time, last year I chose um, NERD Rockstar, so while I was going through the terrifying bit, 
I can just hear, it's almost over now, almost over now. Here it comes. They always look so much slower when you watch them. I know. It's like Hulk. To watch Hulk, it looks so slow coming out that big bit. And it shoots you out so fast. What are we going to do first then? I'm thinking Jimmy Fallon. I think Jimmy Fallon and Could then the mummy. But I think the thing is with Jimmy Fallon, I think you have to get a return time and come back. So I'm not too sure how it works because I know the queue system is slightly different. So we'll see when we get there. If not, we'll do the mummy. We've changed our minds and we're going to do Despicable Me as it's right here. And we didn't do it last year because I don't know. Oh, look, there's. Um... I think it's just because last year we went past oh. and we were just exploring. What is that? Hello Kitty. Hello Kitty. Hello oh, Kitty. Anyway. No, I think we, we did Spitfire Rocket first last time and then we walked around. Yeah. So we missed Minions and, and then we... when we were coming back, we just ended up doing the mummy so many times and we just missed it. Yeah. Time. So let's do it. Yeah, let's do it. Back to the Jimmy Fallon ride, aren't we? Yes. It's being Been built last time we were here. It certainly was. Wow, look at this. Fun fact, we're in the model of where we got engaged, aren't we? We are, so our last holiday, although the ride was being built, we had just been to the real place. Yeah. We just did a Shrek, a Shrek ride as well, and not all that. A lot of standing and waiting for a ride that really wasn't all that, to be honest, so we won't be doing that again. <laughs> You are straight out of Kansas. Okay, so let's try something a little more your style. Here we go. All right, stop. Delivering and listen. I snap with my brand new invention. Something grabs a hold of me tightly. Looks like a hot poop daily and nightly. Will it ever stop? Go. I don't know. Turn off the lights and I'll blow. To be straight, I rock a mic like a vandal. Let the stage go out and chunk like a candle. Ice, 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 baby. Too cold, too cold. Vanilla ice, ice, baby. We just did Jimmy Fallon, race through New York, really good, a lot of stuff I want in the gift shop. Returns now, or the Return of the Mummy. Yeah, Return of the Mummy. It's called. Probably one of my favourite rides in Universal. Oh. Going to the Mummy. Yep. How many times did we do this last year? I know. Last year we did this literally about five times in a row. Just as the park was closing. It's quite busy today, isn't it? I suppose it's a Saturday. Oh uh, yeah. Of course. Here we go. Let's do it. was amazing, we rode it twice, twice in a row, and it's not even two o'clock yet. Now we're going to do Transformers before we get lunch. This is where you lost your hat last time. Yeah, I lost my hat on this last time because I'm a bit of an idiot, and I forgot it, but I won't forget it this time. And you got it back? I got it back because the nice people who let me in. Another 3D VR motion ride. Cannot wait, obviously. Let's do it. Transformers, awesome as always. Yeah, I forgot how good that vibe was actually. Yeah, like, I really. It was a good vibe, but it was really, really good. Yeah, really, really good. So if you come here, make sure you do it. We're just about to head to lunch in Krusty Land or Springfield Land. 
And Tony wants a crusty burger. Oh, yeah. I remember last year saying it was the best burger I'd ever eaten, so I've been waiting a year for this. Mmm, let's hope you haven't raised your hopes oh, too no, high. I don't think I have, but who knows? Only time will tell. Here's a stage being set up for Halloween Horror Nights, I believe. Oh. Horror makeup show over there as well. I'm sure that will be to do with Halloween Horror Nights. We'll do it one day, just not this year. Yeah, it's just not on when we're here. Yeah. Plus, it's meant to be terrifying. Yeah. And you don't like terrifying yeah, things, no, do you? No, it's literally meant to be like people grabbing you and stuff. I would end up screaming. Grabby. Grabby. Pardon our dust. We are in the process of transforming our park for Universal Orlando's Halloween Horror Nights. Ooh, spooky. Look at all those spooky ghosts. <laughs> Here we go. There's the train from Back to the Future 3. I don't know if it's the actual train, but it looks like it. And here we go, entering Springfield. Oh my God, I love The Simpsons. Oh, I remember the first, last thing, the last thing, you're being in such awe of like, how humongous it is. Yeah. It looks like rain over there. It looks like there's a storm coming in, but luckily with Universal, a lot of rides are inside, so that doesn't matter too much here. We're about to go on the Simpsons ride. Are you excited? Very. You love it, don't you? Yeah. Here we go, let me just get a shot of the front. Wow, I love the front of this ride. It just looks so good, doesn't it? Congratulations! The line's almost over! Only 45 more minutes! This is where we make all the wonder and imagination that fuels our park. Hurry, put on these light vests. Now, if a human being were to enter that room, who knows what events might occur you like? They could grow 50 feet tall, or three extra arms, or an eye where their nose should be, which is painful. Slight palaver with my glasses, wasn't there? I accidentally left them on the ride in The Simpsons. We went to Men in Black, couldn't find them. Bit of a panic, but I found them now, as you can see, my sunglasses. So we went back on The Simpsons ride and found them. We're about to head over to Harry Potter, King's Cross, Leicester Square, Diagon Alley, and uh, walk through there. Because Tony has now seen all of the Harry Potter films, haven't you? Finally. So you can now relate to it. But before we do that, we're going to fill up my Coke Freestyle drink. Oh, Red and Black was good. It's like a shoot 'em up, like a time. Uh, what was the time crisis? Yeah, a bit like Time Crisis, but 3D and lots of theming, and you're in a moving car, which is really cool. I beat crisis? Tony. Tony got 32,000 points, I got 138,000 points. Because you've got the 100, well, the, the bonus, the big bonus. Correct, well, still. I did beat you though, didn't I? Oh, aircon. Let's fill this up. Right, fruit flavours. What fruit flavour should we get? So, get rid of out. Cherry. Cherry, orange, raspberry, grape, lime, strawberry, peach, all oh, peach. Peach might be good, yeah. Peach Sprite. Yeah. Oh. Peach iced tea. Minute Maid. I'm not really a big fan of Minute Maid. Yeah, Peach Sprite, I think. Oh, it's not orange. Mm. Oh, can smell it. Yeah. So Rich is trying his peach Sprite. Delicious. Wow, really good. Putting the camera away because it is just beginning to piss it down, isn't it? And I don't want my camera to get wet, which it currently is doing. So speak to you in a little bit. We're going to Diagon Alley. Oh, 
like just as we get to London, it starts pissing it down. some butter beer there, aren't we? Or I am. And you're going to watch. Mm, you can either have your own one or you'll have none. Rich is just trying butter beer. First of the trip. Very, Very cool. Milk butter beer moustache as well. As you can see, we're in King's Cross. So like being at home. Yep. Especially with the rain. <laughs> yeah, exactly. We like this area, don't we? Yes, it's very, very well done. Yeah, we made it to Hogsmeade. Woo! Not raining as much as it was, so camera's okay for now. Here we are. I feel like it's very apt weather for Hogsmeade to be fair. Because it's quite snowy here. As it's quite snowy here, I feel like it's quite apt weather. <laughs> Sorry? Much warmer though. Yeah. Ready. Are we ready to see Hogsmeade? Oh, oh my god, look how amazing it is. So, so cool. Harry Potter is just the best place to come in Universal. I noticed that the building, but like the whole area, takes up such a long path. Yeah. Honey Jukes. The fact is, it's all shops as well. It's not like it's not just shop fronts, like I said the other day. Dragon Challenge there closed at the moment because it's pissing it down. the three broomsticks and we're going to go to Hogs uh, we're going to go to Hogwarts coming up to Hogwarts coming up there it is look at how huge that is amazing really really amazing it's probably just mind blowing, is the way to describe it. We're just entering Toon Lagoon. Yay! It's so bright and colourful. Isn't it just? Look at that. If you ever want a water ride, if you ever want to get wet on a water ride, this is the one to do it. Which is currently on cherry vanilla coke. Yeah. In your sippy cup. Refilled, haven't we? It's not really a sippy cup, it's more of a strawberry cup. Oh, I just love the, the theming here. Oh, yeah. Marmaduke! Good picture, because if you turn it this way. Okay, it looks like that. So good, isn't it? So amazing. Just no one can be in a bad mood in Toontown. I know, it is just like going to that um, Hogsmeade and Jurassic Park, which was great, but also it was so like, wet and everything. Yeah. And then now suddenly the rain's easing, and then suddenly it's just surrounded by colour and brightness. Yeah. So it does just make you smile.
Yeah, you come from forest into yeah. like the most colourful forest and snow. Yeah, into the most the, into the most colourful themed area I've ever seen in a theme park. And then we get into uh, superhero land, is it or Marvel oh, land or Marvel something? Which has got the Hulk, it's got Spider Man, it's got Doctor Doom's fearful. <laughs> The Hulk is closed at the moment because of the rain and lightning in the air, but just look at the size of it. It's in bloody sane. So we'll do this on another day when it's open. I cannot wait. We're gonna go on Cat in the Hat because Tony likes Cat in the Hat, doesn't she? I like all of them. Oh, I can smell cinnamon. Yeah, I know. Cinnabon. It's not that Chippendale breakfast, is it? Where is it? It's over there. Can you see it? Claire and MJ always rave about Cinnabon. Maybe we should get one. Mm, we did just eat a turkey leg though. That's all. Uh, there. Right, let's go do Cat in the Hat. Then we're gonna probably head back actually because it's raining still and we just feel a bit ugh. And, and uh, we might check out the pool and get room service. Okay, so I'm just gonna see him for the Pow! See you. Uh, we might film a bit of Cat in the Hat. Who knows? Well, you will in two seconds. We're gonna do Cat in the Hat. It's quite cold in here. Never known Orlando to be cold, but I am cold now. Oh. Christmas has come early. We're in the Christmas shop. If any of you know me well, you know that I love Christmas. Who loves Christmas? You do. Who's Mr. Christmas? <laughs> you are. These are cool. Yeah. Oh my god, I, like I love Christmas so much. Like so traditional. People complain really about cute. people complain about Christmas too much. Look. Yeah. And the, the bacon tray. Yeah. And I like the candy canes and the gingerbread man. See, they had one like that last year, but it was smaller. Yeah. What's that? That's such a surprise toy. Yeah. We are back at the hotel. We've just checked into our room. It's very nice. Very nice indeed. Here is. Let me just show you around. Here is the sink bathroom area. We've got two beds. So who knows who will get each bed? I'm joking. Obviously, we'll be sharing a bed, Tony and I aren't at that stage in our relationship yet to be sleeping in separate beds. But yeah, very nice room indeed. Just now I need to get the luggage, so yeah. Thank you for joining us on another episode of Rich and Tony Vlogs where we went to Universal Studios and Islands of Adventure. Join us tomorrow for Tony's birthday when we go to Bush Gardens where we'll be doing lots of fun things as always. Please subscribe for more videos and see you again soon.